There's been some issue about, uh, yeah, let me show you, hang on a second, uh, about what cars you can bring into this, uh, reaching peaks thingy, uh, because when you enter the race and you view eligible cars, you got one, two, three, four, five to choose from. Uh, this is the game being broken. This is one of the bugs that isn't there because there's no bugs in this game. Remember this. There is no bugs in this game. It's all in your mind. So you got one, two, three, four, five cards to choose from. This is not the case at all. Uh, I think I have pretty much every car in the game apart from a few pre-order cars. So what you do is you go into your car and you use filter and you go down here, blah blah blah, where is it, off-road buggies, select that, hit escape and now you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, yeah, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve cars to choose from. All, all of these cars are technically uh, allowed to be used. Now some of these cannot be tuned to a B700 so they're of course out but any car of these that can be tuned to 700 is uh, uh, eligible. The game just I don't know forgets to show you but it's not a bug remember this is not a bug the game is not bugged at all so, yeah, you can bring any of these if you can tune them to B700. Now, I've, this morning I've, uh, I decided to take another look because I could see from your comments on my original uh, post where I got my ass kicked twice um, that you guys were having trouble as well. And some of you were uh, saying that Oh, well, you can't bring the Baja bug because the Volkswagen doesn't show up in the eligible. Well, everything you see here is eligible. Okay? It's just the game that's being stupid. Uh, now, this morning, I've been running it... What am I... I've recorded three events. No, oh, two events this morning, sorry. One using the uh, Desert Dingo thingy. This one. And one using this one, uh, which I've both uploaded and for your viewing pleasure or whatever. Now, I haven't seen the AI use any of these, the Can-Am. And this is the, uh, the car that kicked my ass last night. Uh, and you may wonder, well, why don't you use one then? It would make be so much easier, and you're right. It would be uh, if I could use any car I wanted. I would not be using uh, this one or this one. I would probably be using this one or yeah, this one. But you see this little icon that says that's a downloadable. That's either from Car Pass or whatever. And this one, we got in a prize. So these are not cars that anyone can go and buy in the shop. Now the whole point of me doing this is to use cars that anyone can go buy in the shop. Or uh, obtain easily. Uh, I've been using the TVR Cigars Forza Edition a few times. Well, more than a few, actually. Uh, but that's ready, readily available. All you have to do is buy regular cigars and put some... Uh, 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 yeah. The skill points into it. And you get the Forza Edition version for free. So, I can't use this one because that's a prize car. I can't use this one. I can't use this one. I can use this one, or this one, uh, 
and I can't use... Well, that's about it. The rest I can use, I think. Uh, but I've always, in these P700 buggy races, used uh, this one. Because it's relatively fast, even in the B700. And it's stable, and it's drivable. So, yeah. Anyway, that was just a yeah short explanation as why I do as I do and also what you can bring to this race and while I'm at it um, it has been suggested that I'm paid in some way by Chen Chen or by Microsoft or by some other company uh, for doing these videos and the more you view my videos the more millionaire I'm gonna be <laughs> I wish this was true. Uh, I can promise you, hand on heart, I have not received anything for doing this. The only reason I started doing this was to get people to use my tunes. So I can obtain the legendary rank and I can set any price I want in the auction house. That is the only reason I started doing this. Uh, since then, it has been more of a, well, I kind of like helping out. And I kind of like helping out the new guys, because I remember what it was like when I started this game. And it was very confusing and very, yeah, annoying, to be honest. Uh, because if you went in search of a tune, you would get 50,000 tunes to choose from, and you would have to try them all. Uh, basically to find something that works and that kind of pissed me off and I almost gave up on the game actually uh, so yeah the only thing I'm doing this for is uh, for you guys to like my tunes when you use them or use my tunes uh, at the very least uh, I do not receive any money for this, I do not receive any favors or hardware or anything for this. This is purely for you guys using my tunes, nothing else. Um, and in fact, Turn 10 hates me, it's a pretty good word. Um, I have filed legal action to get a... Uh, uh, to get my money back on the Lego expansion because I feel that they sold something that contained the bug that was already present in the uh, oh, what's it called Fortune Island expansion. So they've known about the bug for yeah the better part of seven eight months something like that and still chose to send out the new DLC containing the exact same bug. So I claim they sold me something broken. They knew it was broken. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to get my money back. Uh, hopefully. I was actually contacted by a, a guy from Microsoft who was pretty pissed off uh, about the lack of support we're getting. Uh, and on the same note, I can say, and this again, I'm not getting paid to say this, uh, Microsoft uh, is just a distributor and has nothing to do with the game as such. Um, the support department is being run by Turn 10 and they don't give a shit. So yeah, there you go. So, to sum up, no, I do not get as much, uh, as, much as, yeah, one cent, one nothing. I'm not getting anything for this at all this is purely on my own time and this is purely for for you guys to be using my tunes so that i can get the legendary status will i continue to do this after i get the legendary most likely if i ever get the legendary <laughs> uh, if i'm not banned by then <laughs> which is more than likely actually anyway that's it uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next week, or in the next video, or, yeah, whatever. <laughs> Bye!